Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Let's talk about it, Media 21. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and please hit the notification bell. That way, every time I upload a video, you will be the first one to see it. Note, all comments are alleged, in our opinion, from the different articles we're going to talk about today. It's being alleged that since Megan Stallion did an interview with Gail King, they're asking Tory Lanez to do an interview as well, because now she's now said her side they also want Tory Lanez to speak they're in middle of litigations they really shouldn't be talking at all but he declined the interview on the next clip is showing LeBron just spending family time with his children and it's also saying LeBron wants to own a Vegas team and in the next clip Married to Medicine is actually coming back that was a pretty good clip in regards to Married to Medicine. Um, I'm not certain if I'll review it or not. We'll see what happens. With Married to Medicine, very, very successful women on the show. Doctors, dentists, they talk about um, selling property. They show family time. They show uh, them sp spending quality time together. So Married to Medicine is a pretty good show. Their drama is lessened because these are professional people. So might review it. We'll see what happens. But I'm happy that that's coming back. Might play this clip towards the end, just a snippet of it. But yeah, Married to Medicine. It's being alleged Britney Spears is actually married. And it's being alleged that her ex tried to bombard her wedding. And unfortunately, he was arrested for trespassing, but he was arrested. So he was trying to stop the wedding. And allegedly, Britney's mom and sister wasn't there. There's a lot going on with Britney's dad. That whole conservatorship issue was a problem. Because why, if they knew she was being surveillance, why didn't anybody do anything about the whole situation? That was crazy in itself. Do I think she should be posting what she posted? No. Because nobody should see her, her her like that. But here nor there, she can do what she wants, she grown. The next one we're going to talk about is Pete and Kanye. It's being alleged that Kanye is not happy that Pete is spending quality time with his children. And I don't blame him. Most of the world, <laughs> if you're sane and normal, most of the world is not happy that Pete is spending time with Kanye's children and Kim's children. But here nor there um, is concerning because of his jokes. It's concerning because of how he treats his ex-girlfriends, period. This is Kim's choice, but let's protect the children. Let's make sure the children are safe. If you want to do whatever you want to do, Pete, that's on you. But in regards to those kids... It's, it's important for you to have them around someone that's strong in mind, body, soul, and spirit. Okay. Okay. And the next one we're talking about, it bothers me. Because a lot of people are saying they think they need counseling. Things aren't right over there. Pete needs to be in counseling, stay in counseling. Kim, everybody's saying she needs to be in counseling, stay in counseling. People are saying... Tristan needs to be in counseling, stay in counseling. The normal one over there is Courtney. And Courtney is not liking how she's being portrayed on the show. And Chloe. Chloe needs to be in counseling and stay in counseling. Because you look at these unhealthy relationships and there's an issue. You have a man that's trying to protect Kanye, trying to protect his family from the world, media. And then you allow in him to take your yours and Kanye's children out without Kim being there, she should have called Kanye. Kanye, do you want to be in the vicinity? Do you want to be the security for the day? You know, something, something. Those are his kids too. Those are his kids too. And the father should have the ability to say who he wants his children around. So that's probably why the other attorney kick rocks <laughs> I don't even know what to say that's probably why he probably doesn't see how Kanye feels about his kids 
and he wants to protect his children from this world and media. And I don't blame him. I don't blame him. I don't blame him from what we've seen, from what we heard. And Kim has all this media press trying to get people to like Pete. For people that are sane and see what's transpired, we see it. We heard it. They're trying to push out all that negative, bad press about him in regards to the jokes about baby. So now it's a media frenzy to make him look like a decent person. And then she was like, oh, he's so good. He's so kind. Yes, people do change. They do. They do for the moment <laughs> to get you. And then somebody was saying how she liked him for his parts. Somebody was saying how... um. What were they saying that he said, I'm going to make you be uh, cozy up to me. I'm going to make you fall in love with me. He was saying something controlling narcissistic words, allegedly, here nor there. But this Tristan thing should not even be a storyline. They're seeking storylines. I'm so tired of it. Only reason why I'm talking about it is because a lot of people are saying, are they okay? No family in the world. And, and I know, look, I know the media, the people in the industry, just look at them as a joke. This has to be laughter for other people because no family has this much drama and conflict. But I don't blame Courtney for being upset of how she's being portrayed. She says she don't like it. She don't appreciate it. So I'm going to play this clip real, real fast. This is probably the only clip I'm going to play um, because I'm trying to make this video short, but I know it's not going to happen. One time, Pete was like, babe, let's go get some ice cream at Thrifty. And I was like, oh, my God, you are making me so horny. So sorry, something's wrong. She's trying to gaslight Kanye. We all know it. This that's 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 whack. She's a billionaire talking about going to get some ice cream. And then she was saying something about cleaning up her kid's room, make her feel that same way. Something wrong. They really need to be in counseling. We now don't need to, um, it's not to embarrass, it's not to, but there's something wrong. There's something wrong. She's dated so many people. There's something wrong. Allegedly, 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 fair use, fair use, fair use. Copyright disclaimer under section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976. Allowance is made for fair use. But here are their whatever and then people are kind of feeling bad for chloe no chloe can constantly put her, that man in her life after the boat thing after him walking in the hotel with a girl trying to push up on your sister no no get counseling and figure it out allegedly get counseling figure it out sit down with somebody and I kind of think they're watching my videos because certain things I say, oh, she should be helping the homeless or she should be doing more for the community. And then they're allegedly saying that she's supporting a mayor that has concerns in his history. Here nor there, they can make the choices they want to make. But a lot of it's drama, a lot of it's conflict, a lot of it's not healthy. And on this show, you know, let's talk about it, Media 21. We speak about healthy and safe relationships. So well wishes. I just wanted to go over a few topics for today, um, some things that I have been seeing. Some days I'm just going to head and do rapid topics. That way I can get them out of the way. But here nor there, as a mother of four, you're speaking like this out loud. As a mother of four, she's speaking like this out loud about this man. Here nor there. She can do what she wants. She can say what she wants. But I don't blame Courtney. I'm not certain what Courtney's not happy about what, in regards to what she's talking about being portrayed because I really don't watch the Kardashian clips in regards to the whole show. I've never seen the whole show. I see different clips here and there. But Chloe asking the mom if she's really married. Chloe's looking extremely thin. The glasses were like, oh, it's, it's sad. Kim's one eye is kind of getting lazy. I'm sure she's probably gotten that fixed by now, but yeah, the girls are getting older and it's showing and you know, it's it's a sad thing. This Travis Scott thing with the Astro World, you know, it's sad that there's so much going on in the world and he's reveling in every time he gets a gig, 
he's so happy you could tell because that i don't know the cancel culture is real but here nor there thanks for tuning in to let's talk about it media 21 please like comment and subscribe and please hit the notification bell that way every time i upload a video you will be the first one to see it no all comments are alleged i'm gonna click on this real quick in regards to kim kardashian labels tristan thompson baby mama a random after finding out about the secret child who is she to be calling anybody a random who who their relationships aren't healthy this this pete relationship's not healthy the chloe continued to let tristan in you know you live and you learn you live and you learn he keeps doing things and he he Every time she accepts him back, he does something worse. That's the sad part. You throw him a birthday party and then within uh, 24 hours, he's sleeping with somebody else. Not appreciative. Women, teach your daughters different. They are showing us what not to do. Allegedly. Thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And please hit the notification bell. Thanks for